If you were to measure uh, your oar lock or row lock height, you would come from the highest part of the seat outward to uh, to your rigger out there and with your pin, and you would measure from the highest part of the seat up to uh, the bottom or some set part of the uh, oar lock. As long as it's consistent throughout the boat, even if it's not the highest part of the seat you're always measuring from, just always measure from the lowest part or from the highest part or from the middle or wherever it might be, just keep it all consistent. Uh, we have actual seat height, and so that's going to be uh, adjusted with seat pads or uh, seat pucks could raise the seat height, and that could be good if you had an athlete with uh, really long legs and a short torso and you want to make them fit into the boat better. So to measure the row lock height above the seat, we went ahead and set up our little active tools uh, set up here. We've got our uh, measuring stick down to the top or the highest part of the seat. We've got this guy adjusted here and we're aiming our little laser dot right at the middle of the oar lock. That's where we've decided that we're gonna make our measurement from. You can make it from anywhere just as long as it's the same throughout the boat. And so we've got it all set up there. We can read it here. We're just shy of uh, 17 centimeters above the top of the seat. So that's our uh, seat height measurement. If we wanted to um, go ahead and do another seat, we could take this and just flip it around, set it up here. So we'll just adjust our laser. There we are. And we can read our measurement there and we're again just below 17.